Hello and welcome back to our Tectosagia game. We need to go and teach uh, these silly Scythians that we are not to be messed with and uh, we, we shall not be accepting the messing that he is doing. Uh, we're currently importing grain. How about no on that one? And how about instead Europa? Hey buddy Europa, do you want that grain? Yeah you do, but not from Rome apparently. Oh well. Ah, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Super fine, super duper fine. So yeah, I'm hoping that I can stabilize. I have, I've stabilized it. The food is going up. People are no longer gonna starve. They're only starving in Chalcodon. Uh, that's silly, why are you doing that? You should be doing that one instead. Um, let's, let's entice some businesses there. Uh, we need a new apothecary. You can do that job. So yeah, Tectosagia, we have stabilized this entire fucking thing. There are so many barbarians. <laughs> oh shit. You know what? Fuck it, I don't care. We just need to beat the Scythians, basically. Like that's that's the entirety of the issues that we face right now. Um Whatever. Just just do nothing. When in doubt, do nothing. This is annoying, but I'm not gonna bring any. You know what, the only way that there's going to be an army to clear this up is if a, a leader dies and a new retinue starts. That's the only way I'm going to give a shit. I just want I just want peace. Just white peace and I will be happy. Otherwise, Bosporan Kingdom, you have my full freedom and, uh, and blessing to murder the ever-living piss out of the Scythians. I would, I would actually kind of love that, so I'm going to try and help him do it. And hopefully one of my tribal guys dies so I get a new Renu over here. This is Pish. Can't really afford it right now either. I could probably buy one of these Merc stacks. Create a tribal vassal. Mm, he's in Volcay territory. He probably wouldn't like that. Fine, we'll do that. Get you to get some uh, morale, and then you can kill this. And then we'll disband you again. I lost a siege. That's unfortunate. Oh yeah, he took this siege. To the shame to be sure. Right, you can kill this, you get morale for winning a battle. If you actually find the battle. Fucking find the battle, you bastard. Catch him. I think you've caught him, but if you haven't, move there. There we go. Right, that's a stack wipe as well. Go take that back. Hey, 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 no, 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 I can't move there. I have to wait until this is sieged. Uh, I'm doing it with level 4 general, which is better than nothing. But not by much. Oh wow, Boss Born Kingdom is now dead. Scythia has exploded in population. Boss Born Kingdom is no more. That is a shame. I do enjoy being the Boss Borns on the map. If he just held on. I would have totally won the war for him. Anyway, that's mine. You can kill them. You can go in as well. Wait until he's locked. Now we'll fight him here if we can get there before he does. Yeah, we did. Oh, we split them. That's probably not good. It's more like he split me, to be honest. Oh yeah, we're fucked. <laughs> Shite. And now they're both gonna get stack wiped, I think. Can you finish this siege, please? Or at least just assault it. Thank you. 
I'm going to kill the bloody dudes. You just want a white piece, because, like, dude, dude, white piece would be fucking sweet right about now. We find Sarmatia. Why are we also at war with Sarmatia? You get into his lands and just start sieging. Random shit until he wants peace. Stay away from the forts and just siege as much as possible. Yeah, I, I ran out of money. What happened to the mercs? Oh, they just stopped being mercs. But I have a new retinue and it's actually got horses in it, which is, you know, better. But we're just going to annoy him by sieging as much as possible with this retinue. And then uh, hopefully that's going to force him to want white piece. Fuck you. Oh, damn it. Can I have can I have some troops? Give me some troops. Give me some troops. Give me some troops. Oh, just give me some white peas. Offer peace. Suggest. I'm not giving you this. Nope. Nope. I mean, I have the troops to do it. I just, I can't be fucked. Like, straight up. I also don't have the money. I have a tribe of retinue here I might try and use. But I have no boats to get them over there. And probably don't have the military access either. You just go on defend borders. And deception. There you go. You got stack wiped. Oh no, Chalcedon's just been absolutely fucking wrecked. That's not good. Can I have some peace? Um, yeah, do that. Starving pops in Chalcadon and Purea. Uh, Patea even. Why are you starving? You're losing food. Import food. There is no food to import. White piece would do you good, buddy. Lost the siege. What do you want? Nope. Look, Sarmatia. Sorry, Scythia. We're gonna have a white piece, believe me. It just depends on how long until you want to accept that fact. That's what we're dealing with right now. Liberate Albacensia. Where is Albacensia? I think it's over here, isn't it? Albacensia. That's a huge wave of territory. Decline that. But that is a lower peace deal and he doesn't want Europa anymore. I guess we're making progress. Nope. What is this negative war score from? Occupations? But that's all gonna go away. White piece, there we go. Told you there was gonna be a white piece. Also, Byzantium is now my capital city. Yay. Okay. Now, we have now got our capital here. The food is coming in. Uh, it should be coming in more because of capital city. Capital Territory, plus 1.5. Lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Everyone should be converting a little bit faster as well, I believe. Because of Capital City. Ah, uh, now I'm at war with Bithnia. Of course. Of course, why not? Well, um... Who did you bring in? Because uh, this is going to be fucking awesome you have not got even close to the amount of troops that you need. This is gonna be fucking awesome. This is exactly the territory I needed as well. Money's going down, but you know what, it's fine. We're gonna gain a lot of money from uh, Bithynia. And a lot of territory too. 
So, uh, yeah, thank you. I definitely need to get rid of this, though. Uh, do you want to give me military access? Does anyone here want to give me military access? No. 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 You would have a guarantee. Uh, who's, who's got the biggest opinion of me? Negative 18 is fine, right? Let's improve relations. This level 10 general as well is going to be fucking useful. Starving Pops just in Chalcodon, but that's not going to be the case for long because we're going to take some vegetables, we're going to take some fish, we're going to take all that shit, it's going to be great. Yeah, that was a silly idea, wasn't it? That was super silly. You know what, I think? I think that was silly. I think he's brought some fr uh, friends in as well. Pop conversion speed, I like it, I don't care that I'm going into debt for it. Who did you bring in as a friend? Amisos. Amisos, they're rather large. You've got 28k, you got you got 56k again. What? This was not the case a moment ago. Nonia needs a dude. Eh. Fine. Lance from Macadon? Sure. Hey Macadon, do you want to come help? Cold Worms? No, because opinion? Do you not get like <laughs> massive opinion? Dishonored Alliance, this is going the wrong way. I should have the negative opinion of you for you dishonoring my alliance, not the other way around. Also, I love, I actually don't love, I think it's terrible, but, um, this has got a food shortage, but the, the, there's a bunch of food here. Actually, no, 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 it makes no, it actually does make sense. It's a food shortage in the, the fort itself, not in the province. No, that's actually fine. I lied. Why is there fucking 54k? I know exactly why. Conqueror, yay. Look, if you want to come over here, that'd be great. Because then I can backwipe you. Thanks. Yeah, get fucked. Go away. Right, when the Siege of Nicomedia. Good stuff. You go back to Chalcadon for a little bit. Right. Who was it that I was improving relations with? I think it was you. Yes. I'll keep an eye on that. More food? More anything? Step horses would be nice. I do have some step horses here. Is there a province with step? Yeah, there we go. Colonize that. Now you can import some step horses. I have two units of step horses, therefore I can import step horses. You'll probably have to wait for a multi tick. Right. Now, step horse me up. I don't have the money, that's why. Yay. Ah, <sighs> crashed on the bike. See, this army I would really like to move into my new area. But I need some military access before I can do it. If I offer you a guarantee temporarily, you're gonna give me military access, right? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I mean, your opinion should be good enough to give me military fucking access, you bastard. Come on! Oh, 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 hello. Big, 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 big. Big shit happening. You go siege that. 33 versus 38. I should win this comfortably. Especially considering, look at the units that they're using.
Oh lordy. You need to run. That was a nice win. We lost 8,000, but he lost 18,000. We do need to back up just a bit, though. And now he's got 70,000. I need that military access right about now. Come on, one month. Come on, you bastard. Give, give military access. Thank you. And that's how you get your troops where you need them to be. Yeah, there is so many troops here. I think I need everybody together. And even that might not be enough. Because he's got another 30k here. Uh, Marlon Army uses sounds nice. Come on, come on. Oh no, he's got horses versus my horse archers. I am killing more than he is, but my morale is just diabolical. Once we get rid of his uh, light horse, we should be okay, I think. But we are losing badly. That extra 20k would be real nice around now. And look at the amount of men we're killing. I really want to stay in as long as possible. Uh, until he starts flanking me. But he's still losing twice as many as we are. Four times as many. Three times as many. Mm, sort of evened out. Let's run. 43,000 versus 20. I mean, it, it was still totally worth it. Totally worth it. Deselect move there, deselect move there, deselect move there. And we've got this 24k as well. So as soon as these sort of come back, I will, um, you know, attack again. I mean, I've got this fort here. Terrain is identical, so it doesn't matter which. I can take it back, it's fine. Hey, you bastard, I forgot about that. I have a fort here, but apparently it doesn't matter. Uh, but yeah, if you want to cross over into there, I am happy to oblige. I think you definitely made a mistake here, buddy. I think I need more... Um, Mm, that sounds nice. I de definitely think I need a few more uh, light cavalry rather than so many horse archers. Like the half and half split is good. Horse archers, though, when he's got a lot of heavy infantry, is really, really good. Still, look at the amount of damage I'm doing compared to the amount of damage I'm taking is still definitely in my favor. I mean, I've got lots of horse archers versus his light, uh, sorry, heavy infantry, which clearly is not going to go well for him. Going to come in with some more. Don't like fighting heavy cav. Nothing I've got counters heavy cav. I mean, horse archers are still just ridiculously strong, so maybe that is the counter. Just more good troops. Well, who is this? You are a clan chief uh, here. You can have a holding in Lysimachia. Be happy. And you are governor of Dacia. Friends. There you go. Fixed. Oh, look at the fucking kill disparity. It's fantastic. I mean, he does have a negative three on every roll. It's no wonder that we're winning. <laughs> this battle's taking so long. I'm just excited to see what the end result is. Oh, he's starting to run. And he has fallen. He has fallen entirely. If only I had a boat. Alas, I do not. Spread out, see what we got left. 
Hey, you got a lot of troops left. You're gonna go straight there. You got a lot of troops. You're gonna go there as backup. You're fairly close to full strength. So I think you're gonna go there. Cold War. Dude! You won't accept my Cold Warms, but you'll ask me for Cold Warms. Rude dude. I think my capital is very well protected. What can we build here, actually? It's funny as well, because I, I instantly made the, the loyalty 100%, so I can do whatever the fuck I want. It's great. Um, I want to check out the conversion. I mean, it is converting uh, religiously, which is great. Uh, as soon as the religious conversion is good, then um, they will start converting culturally afterwards. Like, that's really good. It's really, really good. Aqueduct is good. Barracks is there, eh. What I would like to do is build a theater and a temple. Or two temples, really. Would be better. But yeah, if we can take this, we, we can we can probably knock you out of the war soon. Yeah, 14 reasons. But that's going to come in another episode, because for right now, I do need to take a short break here. Thank you all very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. And if you did, feel free to click the like button. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye for now.